Hi, Trevor Tyson with K-Bands Training. I want to give you this great superset to kind of work your obliques, work your core, as well as building your hip muscles. So it's going to be good. You can use it at the gym, stick it in your workout, even do this thing at home. Grab your KB Power Bands. You're going to wrap that thing around a pole, put on your K-Bands, and what we're going to do is we're going to do an extended punch with a side lunge, kind of a shift in our hips. It's going to engage our whole entire body here. So get in a nice position with this thing taut. You're going to take a lunge, reach out and extend this arm. So see this position that you need to get in with your legs. You want to roll over onto your back toe and you want to shift forward, driving this arm out in front of you. Then you're going to come back, come to a nice position here, centered in your body, and then extend back out. You're going to get in a bit of a rhythm, but the whole time you're going to stay controlled. You're going to get about 15 to 20 on each side here. But the key is that you got to shift in your hips. Don't sit in the middle and just turn it over like this. I don't want it to be just a chest exercise. Shift the hips, roll that back foot out flat, and just start getting that body moving. Your heart rate's gonna climb really fast because you got a lot of resistance. And remember, you can make it even tougher by adding more resistance bands here. So mess with it a little bit at home, and then let's move on to the other side. Get your right hand, same thing here, nice and spread out base. Remember, it's all in the hips. So we gotta shift and extend, shift and extend. Back foot's gotta get straight, roll out in your hips. It's like that, 15 or 20. Get your heart rate up. Open the chest and extend it out. Get your 15 or 20. As soon as you get down with that, you're gonna jump right into a side to side hop. Get in your four point position. You're going to hop those feet up even with your hands. Back and forth. That's going to be for 30 seconds, all right? Take a look at the form so when you do it at home, it'll feel real natural for you. Hands are here. Try to get these feet all the way even with your hands. Get them to here. Bring them back down. All the way up to the other side. Take that little workout, mix it in with your other workouts, and you're going to get winded very easily, and you're going to work your core. Make sure you subscribe above if you're liking what you're seeing. Also, comment below the video if you have any questions for me. I'm here to help.